Hello friends, welcome back to my channel V Packers. In this video, I am going to explain Mass Olympiad class 5 sample paper for you. Pattern and marking scheme and syllabus is given. You can pause the video and review it. Question 1. If the following numbers are arranged in descending order, then what will be the middle digit of the number which will be exactly in the middle? So we have to arrange all these numbers in descending order. So numbers are arranged in descending order and middle number is 423. And middle digit of 423 is 2. So where is the 2 option? A. So option A is correct. Question 2. Mohit travels 12 km west, then 3 km towards south and 12 km towards east. How far is he from the starting point? So here is Mohit. He has walked 12 km to west and 3 km to south and 12 km towards east. So what will be the distance? It has become rectangle. And since we know the opposite sides of rectangle are equal, so here is 3 km, here is also, it will be 3 km. So, where is 3 km? Option A. So, option A is correct. Question 3. There is a certain relationship between figures 1 and 2. Establish a similar relationship between figures 3 and 4 by selecting a suitable figure from the options to replace question in figure 4. Figure 1. C. Cross is there. One cylinder is there. And one dot is there filled with black color. C. In figure 2, the cylinder has been turned towards right. And this cross is also turned to right and this uh, dot is hollow. So let us go to next figure 3 and we will make a figure. Now I have turned this V towards right. It has become V. Then figure has been turned towards right. And here is the dot is filled and here you can select hollow dot. See the figure. I think it is same figure is there in D. So option D is correct. Question 4. Rectangle ACEG below is divided into four parts. BCDX is square. What is the area of the rectangle HGFX? H, this is HGFX. Let us see. Area of B, X, D, C is 4 square meter. That is square. So, one side will become 2 centimeter. Area of X, F, E, D is 8 square centimeter. So, breadth is 2 centimeter and length will become 4 centimeter. You can divide this 8 by this 2 because breadth is given, area is given. If you divide area by breadth, you will get length. Area of A, H, X, B. A, H, X, B is 16 square centimeter. So, breadth is 2 centimeter. How will you find the length? If you divide 16 square centimeter by side, that is 2 centimeter. So, length will become 8 centimeter. So, area of HGFX will become 8 centimeter because length is 8 centimeter and breadth is 4 centimeter. It is 32 square centimeter. So, option B is the correct option. 
क्वेश्चन फाइव रोहन साइकिल फ्रॉम हिज हाउस टू द पोस्ट ऑफिस देन टू द मार्केट देन टू द हॉस्पिटल एंड देन ही वेंट टू द हाउस द डिस्टेंस आर मार्क इन द गिवेन फिगर वट इज द टोटल डिस्टेंस कवर्ड बाई रोहन नाउ वेर इज रोहन हाउस हेयर लेट इज स्टार्ट ही साइकिल फ्रॉम हाउस टू पोस्ट ऑफिस वन पॉइंट सिक्स किलोमीटर पोस्ट ऑफिस टू मार्केट वन पॉइंट थ्री किलोमीटर एंड मार्केट टू हॉस्पिटल दैट इज सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्स फाइव किलोमीटर एंड हॉस्पिटल टू हाउस दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट सेवन फाइव किलोमीटर इफ यू एड दैम दैन वी विल फाइंड द टोटल डिस्टेंस इट इज टेन पॉइंट थ्री जीरो किलोमीटर सो वेयर इज टेन पॉइंट थ्री जीरो किलोमीटर दैट इज ऑप्शन डी इज करेक्ट ऑप्शन विच इज अ फॉलोइंग is greatest so they are in roman numbers we have to solve them a 43 xl i i that is 43 xl iv that is 44 if you add them it will become 87 now b section lx x i x that is 79 X X X X I X that is thirty nine. If you subtract them, it will become forty. Section C X C I X minus L X V I I I. So X C I X is ninety nine. L X V I I I is sixty eight. So it will become Thirty-one, section D, L V I I that is fifty-seven, X L is forty. If you add them, that is ninety-seven. So which option is greatest? That is D. So your D option is correct. Question seven. Every day mathematics. Mr. Gupta bought a house for. Rupees sixteen lakh seventy two thousand. He spent rupees twelve thousand five hundred eighty two on the furniture and rupees eight thousand five hundred forty on buying the curtains. Then he spent another rupees five thousand six hundred seventy five for preparing the front lawn of the house. How much money did he spend all together? All together means we have to add that. If we add all the money spent, you will get sixteen lakhs ninety eight thousand seven hundred ninety seven. Where is this option? I think this sixteen lakhs ninety eight thousand seven hundred ninety seven. Option B is correct. Question eight. Minnie took thirty five minutes to complete her homework. She finished her homework at twelve point twelve zero five p.m. What time did she start doing her homework? So we have to go backward clock. So here is a clock. So twelve five p.m. He finish. Uh, she finishes the work. and if we go backward 35 minutes let us see 5 10 15 twenty 20 25 30 35 it means it is 11:30 it is pm it will become 11:30 am where is 11:30 am option b Question nine. Mono is thinking of a four-digit number having all different digits. The unit place digit is the greatest one-digit number. When the tens place digit is divided by the thousand place digit, the quotient is two. The difference between the tens 
and hundred place digit is one. The thousand place digit is double of two. So we have to select unit digit first. The unit place digit is the greatest one digit number. I think greatest one digit number is nine. Now we will go to thousand place, leaving tens and hundred. The thousand place digit is double of two. So double of two is four. Now we will go to tens place. When the tens place digit is divided by the thousand place digit, the quotient is two. If we multiply four by two, it will become eight. Now let us check the hundred place. The difference between the tens and the hundred place is one. The tens place is eight. Difference is one, so it should be seven. The difference of eight and seven is one, so your number will become four, seven, eight, nine. Where is that? Option B is correct. Question ten. The given figure is made up of a square and a rectangle. The breadth of the rectangle is one third of the length of the edge of the square. If the area of the whole figure is three hundred eighty. Four square centimeter. Then find the length of the rectangle. Area of a square is. This is eighteen centimeter. Eighteen into eighteen centimeter will become three hundred twenty-four square centimeter. Area of rectangle is three hundred eighty-four square centimeter minus. Three hundred twenty-four square centimeter. That will become sixty square centimeter. One third of eighteen is six. If we divide sixty by six, it will become ten. So ten is the answer. Where is the ten? Option C is there. Thanks for watching the video.